try to fart like once. I ruined my shorts. I'm not sponsored by Solomon. I just spend a fortune on their products. I drink beer, even the night before races. My name is Mike and I'm the back of the packer. The importance of the evening beer. My understanding is that beer is originally invented by a brilliant scientist named Aristotle. And after bathing in a tub of amber ale, he stumbled through the streets of Greece shouting Eureka. And since that time, millions of fans have shared his exuberant enthusiasm for this bubbly love potion. Here's just a few of the reasons beer might help you run an ultra marathon. It's full of carbohydrates and other things that make you run really fast. Carbohydrates are the body's main source of energy and happiness. Mm. Beer is high in calories. You're gonna need all those calories if you're gonna run a hundred miles. Beer makes me feel funny. I'm getting a little bit of foam. There you go, beer foam. Beer is made with lots of water. Mm. Oh man. I really can't afford to mess up these edits. Beer is made with lots of water, so it probably hydrates you, which is good for your kidneys, I think. Sometimes beer can motivate you. Whew. Sometimes beer can motivate you. I've run the last three hours of a race only thinking about what kind of beer I'm gonna get at the end. Beer's my friend. <clears throat> Beer contains vitamins like potassium and sodium and manganese, which sounds pretty cool. Manganese. Beer contains soluble fiber, which helps clean out the digestive tract. And that's good. When you're lighter, you run faster. Kenyans must drink a lot of beer. It increases levels of vitamin E in the body, which is an antioxidant, and oxidants are bad. I had an oxidant while I was running once. Three words. Pre-race nerves. Whew. At the wife carrying championships in Finland, the winner of the race gets his wife's body weight in beer. I don't know if that last one's helpful. And there you have it. Three great trips, tips on why evening beer could help you run an ultra marathon. Cheers. <laughs>